What up everybody? We got a pizza delivery in the Chennington Casa today. A nice spicy hot pizza, a Future Funk pizza actually, coming from Core Respect Records as they will be dropping Fibers 810 on vinyl record, an EP that I absolutely love. If you guys haven't heard it yet, check it out. It is a solid piece of Future Funk and it's one of those mature Future Funk pieces I would say. It's kind of like Eevee.exi's Remember which Core Respect also dropped interestingly enough. They both are very similar in regards to how they treat Future Funk today in this modern age of it where you can't just take a disco track and, and put a kick drum on there anymore. There's some real originality on these things and when I found out that this was coming to record, I thought that would be awesome because the EV.EXI vinyl sounds absolutely great by them. It looks great. Yeah, some really solid news for the Future Funk community. Fans of this album are going to love this thing. Uh, but I have a test pressing here. Now this is the first test pressing that I have ever owned. I don't have any test pressings in my vinyl collection. I wanted that blank banshee one, but I don't think I woke up in time and I just kind of forgot to get it. So this is kind of cool. I want to, you know, big thank you to Fiber and Core Respect Records for sending this to me. And now uh, let's check it out. Also really quick, Dear Pad, some fiber for your diet. Thank you, baby. You know me, I don't eat healthy at all. Strictly just Stella Doro cookies and espresso all day in this house, baby. But let's open this thing. I'm pretty stupid. I think all I had to do was this, right? Yep, I'm done. All right, anyway, here we go. Let's check this thing out. Let's open it up. What do we got in here? Love you, Pad. Thank you for all your support. Keep the faith, boy, Allen. P.S. No discogs. Don't worry. I ain't flipping this thing, baby. I'm gonna keep that. I think I'm gonna frame. I want to start collecting test pressings. So maybe I'll frame it. I don't know. Maybe make a big like thing on the wall of like just all a bunch of test pressings. I think that'd be kind of cool. And I don't read uh, Japanese, but let me put this over here. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so we have like a time code sheet. I guess this is what they send you or you send them when you want to get a pressing done. I don't know. And here it is. I have never seen a test pressing before, so this is really, really cool. It just feels like it's like fresh out of a factory looking at this thing. Yeah, I've never ever owned a test pressing, so this is the first one. Let's take this guy out of here. They were saying there is a defect in this record. I can't really see it from here, like from first glance at all. Uh, it looks pretty clean to me. I mean, I don't really care honestly about if there's a defect or not. I just think it's cool to own a test pressing and just get something in its rawest form. I'm gonna spin this thing. I wanna hear how it sounds. Stay up to date with them because Course Bike's dropping some good stuff and um, you're gonna want this thing on vinyl. This, this is a killer album. It's a powerful album and it's just some solid funky stuff, baby. Mm -hmm. 